Brazilian officials have told the BBC that there's been an aggressive increase in deforestation since the election of President Bolsonaro in January. An area of Amazon rainforest roughly the size of a football pitch is now being cleared every minute. The rainforest, which plays a vital role in regulating the Earth's climate, covers an area 20 times the size of Britain. Nearly two-thirds of it is in Brazil. Crucially, it absorbs billions of tons of carbon dioxide every year and produces 20% of the oxygen in the atmosphere. In the first of a series of reports, our science editor David Shipman has been to see how decades of conservation efforts are being reversed. The rich greens of the most vibrant habitat on Earth. The billions of trees store so much carbon, they help to slow down global warming. They're also home to an amazing tenth of all species in the natural world, some unnerving, Others adorable. But the sight of bare earth and dead trunks is becoming more common, with huge tracts of forest wiped out. My footsteps and distant bird song are the only sounds. It's tragic to see this close up. To bring these trees down to the ground, they just knock them over with a bulldozer. This is happening all over the Amazon to create new farmland. And the result is that the great forest has never been under such pressure. Over the decades, field by field, many trees have made way for agriculture. But that's set to speed up because of a massive push for development. The new president of Brazil, Jair Bolsonaro, was elected on a promise to exploit the Amazon. He's delighted his supporters by saying too much of the forest is protected. His environment officials are deeply worried, but he's banned them from saying anything in public. You're trying to save the forest. So we have to meet this official in secret. His face hidden and voice changed. He says the government is trying to cover up the loss of the forest. Eles não querem que a gente fale porque nós vamos falar a verdade. Nós vamos falar que as unidades de conservação estão sendo invadidas e estão sendo destruídas. Há muitas pessoas fazendo marcações de lotes de propriedades rurais dentro de áreas que deveriam estar sendo protegidas. E os números de desmatamento aumentam, mas poderiam ser ainda maiores. And the scale of the deforestation he describes is staggering. Up here, at the top of this 50 meter high observation tower, the view is just phenomenal. Out over what looks like a great ocean of green. This is the canopy of the largest rainforest in the world. The problem is that more and more of it is being chopped down. It's hard to believe, but an area the size of a football pitch is being cleared every single minute. What that means is that forest that could cover more than 2,000 pitches is just vanishing every day. And all the signs are that this rate of devastation will accelerate. Cattle are the biggest single reason the trees are cleared. They're grazing on land that used to be forest. Brazilian beef is in big demand all over the world. And the president's vision of expanding agriculture here has delighted the farmers, like Vandele Wegner, who says other countries cut their forest down long ago. Nós temos que desenvolver a Amazônia, né? Porque vamos supor aqui na região do Baixo Amazonas, na região de Santarém, vive mais de 4 milhões de pessoas. Então, se precisa ter um desenvolvimento também, é um direito constitucional. Farming on an industrial scale has already reached the Amazon, but the government wants to see more of it. And to weaken the laws protecting the forest. We asked to interview two ministers about this, but they both refused. A line often heard here is that only Brazil can decide what to do with the forest, no one else. But the fact is, the more trees are cut down, the more we lose one of the few things holding back the rise in global temperatures. So what happens here in the coming years matters far beyond Brazil. David Schuchman, BBC News, in the Amazon.